Hello guys and welcome back to a brand new video at Lazy Low Collectibles and uh, this week we have a DMC challenge, die custom models community challenge, any sport vehicle um, and this, is, this Porsche is my choice. So let's take a closer look of this matchbox, as you can see it's in pieces and uh, no wheels. Somebody already took this apart and I think uh, they already worked on the um, um, casting. So it looks pretty good actually. I've done a little bit as well, just uh, there was some uh, casting lines, so that's what I removed. But apart from that, I didn't touch anything else on this one. So um, it's gonna be at least easier. I don't need to uh, do the paint stripping anymore. Uh, we got the base. This is a Porsche 959 Matchbox International Limited 1986, made in Thailand. This is plastic and we got the um, uh, suspension, the metal bar, uh, interior and the windscreen as well, which hasn't got scratches, but it's got a little bit um, age to it. So I will work on that. Uh, this is going to be my uh, diecast and modellers community march any uh, um, sports vehicle. So this is going to be my entry piece. So I will uh, wash this again um, and get it ready for priming and I will start working. I've got already replacement tires but I'm not going to show you. In this video I show you a little bit uh, how do I put the decals on. Um, just a few, not all of them because I want to have a surprise at the end of the video how the car looks. So this is one on the top and I also put uh, these are uh, proper stickers and uh, they are numbers so they're not water slides um, that one goes on the door and also on the hood so we have a number on the car and we'll see some of the detailings as well um, this is the indicator i will show you and uh, as you can see my hand holding the car actually i moved one of the um, decals but I couldn't remove it because it was dry already, so it had to be there. You can't really see the difference, but I know it's there. So um, next time I need to be more careful. But anyway, uh, some of the details are done. Indicators, brake lights, uh, and also the front headlights. But apart from that, not much details being done on this car. These are the wheels. I did swap them. I mean, uh, I did find um, other wheels. These are from um, a pair of um, Sikus. Sorry, I had to think what brand is it. And um, yeah, they were quite good, uh, right size as well. But I wanted to change that plasticky um, gray look to this um, goldish color. So we have got the um, Porsche ready for reassembly. Let's quickly take a look what we've done. I haven't touched the base, but I did update the, gray, the wheels. I changed the wheels as well. I mean, I didn't have any wheels. So I um, took these from a Siku and I put um, Aztec Brown on it and I sprayed it clear. And I think they look really good. Um, done a little bit detailing in the interior, not a lot, just a little bit. Um, make it red, uh, black instead of red. Um, this is the windscreen updated. And this is the body which I'm very proud of. I think it, it, it turned out really great. Um, put some stickers on. I've done some little some detailings. And I think it really looks nice. I do like it. Um, so I will put this together. Um, I also tabbed the... Um, poles because uh, this has got a plastic base and uh, if I glue that that will turn white which I don't want um, so I'm going to put this together click it together it should click together and I will put the um, screws in and I will show you on the turntable this is the car before restoration so it's nothing much really no paint uh, no, no wheels. It's just a chassis, the base and the windscreen interior. So I had to find another pair of wheels. And uh, this is the car after restoration. I'm extremely happy. I think it's a big transformation. Um, and I can imagine this car racing somewhere. Um, so I'm really happy. 
um, I love it on the turntable and it will go straight into my cabinet with my other Matchbox cars. So um, just looking at it, um, turn around. Thank you for watching the video this far. Um, let, so let's finish the video now. So I hope you guys enjoyed the car on the turntable. I think the wheels, I'm, I'm extremely happy with the wheels. I think they look fantastic and the stickers are smart. So I'm really happy with the car. I do like the um, details and I, I like the outcome, outcome of the car. Stickers are smart. So extremely happy with it. If you guys enjoyed it, please like the video. Um, also comment. And uh, if you haven't subscribed, then please subscribe. Uh, join the um, Leslie Love Collectibles YouTube channel. And thank you so much for that. Um, have a great weekend, guys. Don't forget to watch the other guys' videos um, on YouTube and also on Facebook. Diecast and Modellers community. Have a great weekend, guys. See you next Friday. Take care and bye-bye now.